Welcome to today's news about the Atlanta Falcons. In the first day of rookie minicamp, the Falcons had their 2023 rookie class, six drafted players, and six UDFAs. Additionally, 41 players tried out, and eight 2022 practice squad players attended. This camp is more focused on the mental aspect of preparing rookies than the physical aspect. Let's dive into the notes and observations from day one. Before we continue, please click on the like button to keep receiving our videos and stay informed. Continuing with the news. During the practice, it was evident that the Falcon six-person draft class was of great value. Bijan Robinson showcased his agility by contorting his body to twist for a pass from Chase Bryce before sprinting down the sideline. O.L. Matthew Bergeron, the Falcons' second-round draft pick, displayed his athleticism and flexibility, playing as a guard. D.L. Zach Harrison's length was obvious, which is a valuable trait for edge rushers. O.L. Javon Gwynn spent his college years at guard, but the Falcons want to see him at center. There were also tryout players who stood out. T.E. Cam Sutton, who is 6 foot 6 and 226 pounds, caught attention as a big target in the pass game and a bigger presence in run support. W.R. J.J.R. Sega Whiteside, at 6 foot 2 and 237 pounds, showed his power as a runner, making him a tough tackle for wiry defensive backs. Additionally, he has excellent blocking skills that can be valuable for the Falcons in the running game. The Falcons' rookie minicamp is more about building these players up mentally than physically, and that is what the staff is focusing on during this time. The players are learning what is required of them and practicing how to transfer that to the field. The Falcons are preparing them for the job they were hired to do. Now tell me, what do you think about this? Do you think building a mentality is important? What's your opinion? Subscribe to the channel and leave your like to be informed daily about everything that happens in the Atlanta Falcons. Go Falcons!